Now let us work out a problem. Amal bought five pens, seven pencils, and four erasers. Rajan bought six pens, eight erasers, and fourteen pencils for an amount which was half more than that of what Amal had paid. What percent of the total amount paid by Amal was paid for pens? Options we have: seventy percent, sixty percent, sixty-two point five percent. None of this. Here, let us write the given data first. Given data says that Amal bought some things, and Rajan Raj Rajan bought some things. That is, Amal bought how many? Five pens, seven pencils, and four erasers. Whereas Rajan bought six pens, eight erasers, and fourteen. Pencils. So now, Amal has paid some rupees x for all these things, and Rajan has paid x plus x by two of things for purchasing all those things. So, money paid by Amal. You can say money paid by Amal. Is equals to e x. Similarly, money paid by Rajan to purchase things is x plus x by two. So rupees x. It also rupees. So now we want. What percent of the total amount paid by Amal was paid for pens? He's asking only out of total he has Amal is paying some extra rupees for all these things, but he's asking the percentage of money that is paid for pens. So now, as for the equation, we can write if you multiply this with two, you will be getting ten p plus fourteen pencils. Plus eighty eighty dollars is equals to x is paying total amount now. So in terms of in equation forms, we can write like this. This you bring Rajan's also here. Six p six p that is six pence. Fourteen pencils plus eight erasers is equals to two x plus three x by two. Now if you subtract, we get only Pens. That is the reason we are writing the equation like this. So this will be fourteen pencils get cancels, eight erasers get cancels. That is four pens. Four p is equals to this four pens cost is equals to two x minus three x by two. That is nothing but four x minus three x. That is four x minus three x by two is equals to four pens cost. So four pens cost is equals to x by two. So four pens cost is x by two, or eight pens cost is x. Cost of some eight pens is x. That is nothing but what as Amal had paid for all the things. But now we want cost of five pens only. Eight pens cost. X rupees. Now we want five pence cost. Say some y like this. So y will be five pence cost. That is five x by eight. So out of x, the x amount is paying five by eight part is paying for pence. Therefore, percentage of Percentage of question asked. What percent of total amount paid by Amal was paid for pens? Percentage of money paid for pens. Paid for that is five pens, or you can say just pens. That is nothing but five by eight of total amount. 
total amount so that is 5 by 8 percentage so 5 by 8 into 100 percent that is 500 divided by 8 so that, that is nothing but 62.5 percent so that is more than half he is spending for pens because 62.5 is it's more than half so he is spending 62.5 percent of his amount for pens so from options we have option c that is 62.5 so option c is correct